Holy frick, dude. That's pretty shocking. BTS, welcome back to Bang Town Boys. Hey, chill out, Hobie, right? Do you want to know a fact? No flex or anything, but quick fact. This, there has been 204 responses on BTS, right? It's been a blend, a cheeky blend, might as well say, exotic blend of music. Normal videos, I guess. I don't know. Funny, slash, whatever, sad, blah, blah, facts. And we're doing knowledge once now, okay? N guess what? It happened again. No one wants a shout out, so... There you go. Link down below to my Patreon. By the way, if guys, you don't know, right? Okay, I post exclusive content on that. <laughs> exclusive. <laughs> what? Oh, oh, you're wondering what it is. Well, hold your briefcase. You have a briefcase? It's a bit weird. I post music video reaction and anything that just gets copyrighted on the channel, essentially. So, yes, I got a haircut, by the way. It's not doing me much favor, but there we go. All right, so today we are reacting to most shocking bzz, 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 facts about BTS. Here we go. If you keep up with the news, you've probably heard of the South Korean boy band BTS. Oh, I was, I, I was going to say, guys, guess what I heard on the radio? I uh, know, I heard, I heard. BTS. It was the Coldplay one. Uh, Cold War? No, that's a game. Coldplay uh, with Chris. Whatever isn't it? Chris Martin? Oh, what what a wonderful world. Yeah, I know. I heard it. I even told my dad. He was like, that. so that's K-pop. Yeah. yeah, he wasn't that amused, but yeah, I told him. And he says, oh, okay. That's, that's pretty cool. RM, Suga, Jin, J-Hope, Jimin, V, and Jungkook have taken the world See, this is what i don't understand about english people well english speaking people i say jimin they say jimin like i want to say suga but then it's sugar like ah give me a break world by storm the band has set numerous records in korea and abroad such as being the first korean act to top the billboard 200 chart and sell out arenas in the us and uk Here's a look at 16 of the most interesting and shocking facts about BTS. I'm sorry to keep boiling, but 16? There's got to be more than that. This man wants just to make his bread. <laughs> See what you're doing, mister. Number 16. BTS reportedly brings in billions of dollars to the South Korean economy. Really? According to a study by Hyundai Research Institute in 2018, BTS brings in about $3.6 billion uh, to the South Korean economy. Uh, this is uh, Really? Did I do that? Uh, yeah. I learned about how they brought in, like, I would say a small percent, but it's still like, you know, 3% or something ridiculous like that on Google. Like, they bring in like 3% GP GDPA, whatever the fuck, I don't know. And essentially, come on, man. Come on, that's like Warren Buffett. This is Ugh. not only because their albums sell really well. A year. But also because many tourists travel to Korea to visit locations related to the group, such as restaurants the band members have eaten at or locations where they've filmed their music videos. Some tourists even fly across the world to go to BTS's concerts. Number 15. Duh. RM is a genius. With an IQ of 148, BTS's leader RM is not only highly creative, but is also a genius. I would say my my IQ is about 70. I'm not even kidding. Like, I am stupid. But RM, like, you are considered a genius, right? If you have, like, over, I don't know, 130 or something <laughs> ridiculous like that. I, I, j I just think, how do you have that much brain? Uh, uh, I mean, <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm G. I am a flipping genius. Albert Einstein's got nothing on me. I mean, the man was probably smaller than me. Yeah. Ah, uh, no, I'm, I'm a small person. But ridiculous, man. It's 48. Ah. He's proved his mental prowess on TV shows like Problematic Men and on BTS's own variety shows, such as Run BTS. Is that? His ability to speak English almost like a native speaker is a testament to his intelligence as well. In fact, he impressively scored 850 points on his TOEIC test in middle school <laughs> by self-studying English. Number 14. All right, I get it. V hates spicy food. Korean cuisine is known for being spicy, especially for non-Koreans living in and visiting the country. 
Naturally, you'd assume all members of BTS would love spicy food. Well, you know what they say about assuming. You make an ass out of you and me. Right? I learned that from my brother. And, um, what's crazy about spicy food, man? I'll put it there. That's my take on spicy food. Go check it out. Link in description. I find spiciness to be one of the most awful things in the world. Why would you put yourself through that much? And people, I've I've heard people just say, well, it adds flavor. It adds something else. Like, why? Just eat vanilla ice cream. Or, I don't know, fried chicken without the spice. Like, you're... <laughs> <laughs> You're just torturing yourself. One member doesn't, and that's V. He's most likely v the this. pickiest eater in the band because Hell he also dislikes coffee and a lot of vegetables. Like, I'm V. <laughs> Literally, I I hate coffee. I hate tea. You name it, that ain't me. Shit. Like, it's what is that? Soybeans. Oh. Number thirteen. V is that. ambidextrous. V has many talents. He can draw, take beautiful photos, and sing in a rich tone. How's that being ambidextrous? It's got being talented. One talent you may not know about is that he can oh, use both him. hands equally well. Although he's naturally left-handed, you'll see him sign. Oh yeah, see, this man is ambidextrous. Let's show some stock footage of a, a woman using her left. Is this satire? Is this video satire? Because I, I kind of know about... I don't know. Finding Man. autographs and using okay. chopsticks with both his left and right hand. What ca I could do that. I Well, if you think about it, I'm that terrible at using chopsticks. Does it really matter what hand I use? You know, I just end up fucking... <laughs> play. And, he do. and now for number 12. But first... Make sure to subscribe before yeah, you leave all right. and click yeah, on the notification the bell same. so you don't miss any of our latest videos. I got two drinks on the Number 12. J-Hope is the only member of the band who doesn't have his ears pierced. Whenever BTS has a new comeback... <sighs> what the fuck am I meant to do with that information? I don't have my ears pierced. Do you know what? I never want an ear piercing, but I don't, you know, I don't hate on people getting it. Next, you'll be saying fucking, he wears two left feet. I mean, two left shoes. Like, what am I meant to do with this information? The members get extravagant new hairstyles. It's not even that shocking. Stylish outfits and dazzling accessories, such as necklaces, bracelets, and earrings. I'm telling you what, this guy will do anything for a build up. <laughs> the band members wear shoes, but guess what? So you'd think all of them would have their ears pierced, but that's not the case, as J-Hope's ears are very much unpierced. However, he has recently started to wear ear cuffs to experiment with his style. Well, then he's just cheating the system. The <laughs> moment was tarnished for the oldest member, Jin, because his pants fell down while BTS performed We Are Bulletproof Part 2. Really? He was so embarrassed that he cried oh, backstage God. after the group's performance. Hopefully. Ooh. This is now a distant memory in the past. Number 10. Okay. RM is good at ice skating. Oh my BTS god. Am I just hating on this video too much? I feel like I am. This leader is a great ice skater, as he practiced the sport for four years. RM even called it his hidden talent. This is particularly surprising because he's known to be clumsy. You can find videos and GIFs online of him breaking sunglasses, floors, phone booths, and a lot of other things. But he's quite graceful Can't put on, on the sunglasses. ice cream. Number nine. What the hell do I say to this? Like, oh, guys, can you do this thing? Like, we do the, the wiggly worm. I always show people and they're like, eee. Right, yeah. Nine. Jin has crooked fingers. BTS oh, performances and music videos <laughs> never cease to impress. With all the amazing things going on, you probably don't have time to catch all the details of the members' oh, appearance, such up, as man? the intricate patterns on their outfits, or even how their hands look. So you most likely never realized that Jin has crooked fingers, probably wow. due to hyperflexibility. This most likely explains why he can also effortlessly do the splits. My man has bendy fingers, so he can do the splits. Hmm. Okay, I didn't think about Number it that eight. way. Jimin and Jungkook were meant to have stage names. Most of the BTS members have a stage name. RM's real name is Namjoon. Okay. Suga's is Yungji. Cool. Jin's is Sukjin. J-Hope's is Ho Suk. And V's is Taehyung. 
However, Jimin and Jungkook used their real names as their stage names. Nonetheless, they almost debuted with stage names like the other members did. Jungkook was almost called Seagull, the official bird of his hometown, Tattoo, and Ian. And some names for Jimin. I'm sorry, but Ian. Ian isn't a fucking stage name. Rey Mysterio, J Hope, like those are stage names. Like <laughs> fucking Ian. Hold up, Ian's about to come on stage. They were Baby J, Baby G, and Young Kid. Fortunately, all the members thought literal, Jungkook's and Jimin's own names sounded better, so they used those instead. Number seven. Ooh. None of the members are from Seoul. Seoul is the. I'm from England, everyone, but I'm not from London. <laughs> most densely populated city in South Korea, so it's no surprise that most K-pop bands have at least one member from the capital. However, not a single yes. member of BTS is from Seoul. Nonetheless, two members are from cities in the Gyeonggi province close to Seoul, but the rest are from Busan, Daegu, and Gwangju, which are quite yeah. far from the capital city. They all must have different Korean accents. Number six. The Thanks. band used to live in one room together. Mm. The BTS members currently live in a luxury apartment in an affluent area of Seoul and have even bought their own properties to rent no, to no, others live in a or to stay in when they, they need more privacy. Their lives may be comfortable now, but at the beginning of their career, all seven members had to share one room. This must have been uncomfortable, but it sure helped them to forge a close relationship with each other. Hell yeah. Number five, Jungkook is afraid of- I heard about this you lot and you guys are telling me and I just didn't believe it. I want to know why he's scared of microwaves. Like, you know, there's always that conspiracy guy who always puts a tinfoil hat and goes up to him and be like, Yarn, that's gonna give me cancer today! There's always that one guy and I mean, I don't- How the hell can you- I mean, Jay Swingler, right, from TGF, he put his head, cemented it, he cemented his head in a microwave. That's who should be afraid of microwaves. What's going on here? How- I want to know, was he nearly got his hand chopped off and put in the mic- I want to know why he's scared of microwaves. Microwaves. Jungkook is the most fearless and daring member of the group because he enjoys extreme activities like bungee <laughs> jumping and climbing. <laughs> he is yes, also fiercely competitive. Okay, but tell me why. he has his own fears like everyone else does. While his bandmates V and Jin are afraid of ghosts, Jungkook fears something that many of us think is harmless. Yeah, okay, get to microwaves. it. Microwaves. When you put food in the microwave, you normally forget about it. Ah, this guy's really frustrating me. Just get to the fucking point. What do you think? When will it be ready? But the main thought that goes through Jungkook's mind is, will it explode? Why is he... S I'm sorry, but I'm hating. I I'm a hater. Like, what is going on? Can he drive a car? Does he get in a car? Does he drive places? You know, there's like a lot percentage chance of getting in a car crash, right? Okay, I'm afraid of that, but I still drive my own car. What is happening? Why is he back it out? What's going on, man? Number four, Suga once stole Jungkook's underwear. <laughs> During an episode of BTS's reality show, Rookie King, Suga confessed to stealing Jungkook's underwear to assert dominance over him. However, when Jungkook previously asked Sugar if he had seen his blood, it's probably not that deep. Let's be honest. To assert dominance, what is he a sigma? That <laughs> what the fuck, Sam? I'm gonna steal your your cabin. Get wrecked, son. No. <laughs> Black underwear. Sugar lied and said he hadn't seen it, even though he was wearing it at the time. <laughs> Jungkook certainly made sure to, to keep fast, an quite eye on move. the rest of his underwear after this. Number three, Jimin almost didn't make it into the band. Wow. <laughs> Jimin is one of the most popular members in BTS, but you'll be shocked to know that he almost didn't make it into the band. He was nearly kicked off the team a whopping eight times and may have not made the final cut if his bandmate V hadn't expressed how he would love to have Jimin debut with him. Thank eight God times. V had Jimin's back. Number two, J-Hope once left BTS. <laughs> really? It's hard to imagine BTS without J-Hope, but that almost became reality right before the group debuted. In an episode of BTS's first documentary, Burn the Stage, the members reminisced about how J-Hope left the band because he thought things weren't going well. Thankfully, 
RM convinced. But my man saw the revenue, saw the possibilities, <laughs> and he was like, what the fuck can I sign my life away right now? Oh my God. That guy was like, what? Really? Is that happened? To J-Hope to return and even explained to Big Hit Entertainment that BTS really needed him on the team. My man's Who a knows where man. BTS well would have ended up well without J-Hope? Number one, BTS almost had a different name. Naming a band is an important process and can take quite a while. True. Before Big Hit Entertainment decided on the name BTS, short for Pangtan Boys or Beyond the Scene, the agency thought of naming the group Big Kids, Young Nation. Okay, they. What is it with some people and the most shittest of names? What is Beyond that? Beyond the Scene, the agency thought of naming the group Big Ki Big Kids, Kids, Young Nation, and other names. We're oh, glad they names. chose BTS instead. Good, yeah. Because it sounds did. so much better. Yeah. So, guys, today I'm going to be reacting to Big Kids. Come on, bro. Shut which up. of these BTS facts do you think is the most shocking and interesting? Um, which one? I forgot. What, hang on. Let me have a sift through them. All. I'll be honest. Jungkook being afraid of microwaves. That was the most shocking to me. Get it? Bang! Get it? Because it's shock I, I don't know anyway so if you, word of the video is microwaves all right yeah straight to the point you know me fred dyslexic bang at it again really hectic oh wait make sure you smash like subscribe press that notification bell links down below to my patreon and everything and yeah i'll guess i'll see you guys tomorrow with another video peace out everyone bye bye oh and i forgot to say patreon i got exclusive content down there if you didn't watch the intro anyway love you guys peace out bye bye